Hi guys, welcome back. This is Mike at MH Tutorials, and today we're going to do another short tutorial. But before I get into that, this is my 200th video on YouTube, and uh, I got a lot of feedback from my subscribers. I'm really happy with that, so uh, I would like to say a huge thank you to all of you guys for watching, liking, sharing, commenting, and so forth. All right, and while we're at it, we're you know it's the 20th of December, so whatever type of holiday you're celebrating, enjoy that. Have a great and healthy new year when it's uh, January 1st. And uh, that all said, let's get to our tutorial. Now, like I said, I recently did uh, a couple of very short tutorials, just like tips and tricks. Today's tutorial is on how to create lens flares in, uh, in Maya, okay? Now, it's really easy. Uh, what you do is you just create a simple light source. Let's say create lights, point light, for example. So we've got that light right there, all right? If we now go into our render settings, and I'll just uh, switch to metal right here, and I'm just gonna hit render. Not too much going on, okay? However, if we go into our point light shape, right? And we go into light effects, you have the option down here for light glow. And if we hit that checkered box right down there, all right, you got the option here to select lens flare. All right, so let's do that. We're not going to change anything else, and we're just going to simply hit render. Uh, let's see, just make sure I got everything set up correctly. Uh, hang on, Maya software. Let's try that again. I'm just so used to using mental ray, okay? So there you have it. It's uh, very neat, very easy. Uh, this is something you see in the movies a lot, right? And you got some options here. I'll just uh, save this for comparison. Uh, for example, you can change the, uh, the glow type from, uh, let's say, linear to uh, exponential. Give that a go. And I'll just switch between these two. Right, we can do uh, a ball. All right, save that one. There we go, and you can see the differences. All right, let's see what else have we got. We got the the lens flare, obviously. Save this, render that. Now that's pretty cool. And you can tweak the uh, the settings here as well, right? You can, uh, we got four star points right now. Uh, let's do, uh, let's say eight. Save this for comparison. And there we go. So here we got four, here we got eight, okay? We can do rotation. Let's say we want a 45 degrees rotation. Save that, render that. Actually, it didn't change anything. Let's do 41 degrees. That might be better. And now we can actually see a difference. All right. Okay, so we got the rim halo. I'll just save this. Here we go. Like that. And you can also uh, select the halo type. All right. Let's do a linear, for example. Save that. Quite different effect, all right? We'll do, uh, sorry, we'll do uh, exponential. Quite bright. Ball. There we go. So one is the, uh, the, the core, so to speak, and the other is the uh, flares. All right, so um, you can do lots more with this. You can change the glow color. Let's do yellow, for example. Uh, let's do blue. There you go. 
So a lot to play with here. You can increase the glow intensity. I'll just uh, show you one more. Very different. And this is all kinds of stuff you can play with, all right? So this is our uh, very short and brief tutorial on lens flares. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed it and see you guys next time. Bye.